The newest grounded update brought a whole lot of stuff to the game, and for those of us who really love tower defense, well the acorn turrets got a little bit of an upgrade. But first, I've got a lot more things I need to do. One of them being making red ant arm guards, all for my quest, and then the other, murdering innocent creatures. Also for my quest, but a little bit for personal enjoyment. It's like that saying, find a job you love and you never work a day in your life? Well, here we are. Hello, Tadpole. Goodbye, Tadpole. Hello, Trudy. Stay over there. In her eyes, I'm the one hit prey. You make three, you make four, and much like when I hold up all my fingers on my hand, you make five. <laughs> this is a stupid joke. And you make six just for good luck, friend. Thank you. Monsieur Burgol, I'm invading your home again. Fitting to history for thousands of years. Give me more stuff. And now I need to make a trip back home because if we're gonna do a crazy base defense, I obviously need to scout out the proper area. You know, I think I've changed my mind. I don't want a second aphid on the zip line anymore. I like being able to think about everything that I need to think about in my day. Just heading back to my house. Gives me time to think about the truly important things too, like you know, when will we ever get a good Pokemon game again? Or like the heat death of the universe? How did you get up there? What do you, uh. So I need clay, silk rope, and weed stems. Silk rope, easy. And clay, also easy. Why did I have this much? Going down. As it's been a while since I've used waft emitters, I'm not really 100% confident on how they work, but I think bugs just kind of spawn in. So as long as you have a nice level area, you can fight, well, most things. So I was thinking maybe we fight somewhere along these rocks here. Wait, that's like a perfect natural hill, right? Oh, I think I know exactly what I need to do. Although there is another area that I want to look at. Just completely on the other side of the yard. Oh, back to the universe heat death thing. Oh, I guess I can kind of half make that. All right. Don't worry, we're only 1200 centimeters away. <laughs> See, this area is just a lot of grass, the occasional spider, and a, oh, a stink bug who spotted me from down there. Is stink bug aggro range like broken game? Be honest with me. All right, I think I like the other area better if I'm gonna be fighting for my life, <laughs> which just means I guess I'll figure out string theory this time. Ah, oh, day of victory, here it is. Oh, and the little dude who's busting the move. All right, do I have anything to eat? Oh, thank you. I should probably cook these dead corpses, huh? All right, buddy, come with me. I'm gonna place you before I hit the ground. That didn't work. Oh, but I didn't go out of my little mode. Sweet, a little fall damage, never hurt anybody. I need some more weed stems. Come on, Mr. Husky Weed. Wow, that is all over the place. All right, smack all of you guys in and come on, smack you down and send some weed stems down that way because to make an acorn turret I actually have to manually place it which is bad in that case maybe I need to slide the rest of these guys down and then follow after them too quick too quick and stick the landing thank you uh, you know what screw it just take a little bit of damage we're fine hello base of operations gotta do a quick little harvesting like we're back to square one give me some sap need these sprigs chop down a tree the usual stuff now I can get me a little workbench down thank you and i for some reason did not think to bring the rest of the materials i needed oh i need like seven goldfish from now on it's okay i've gotten good at building these things and zip line if you're curious no still haven't organized these things yet also give me this blaster got something in mind for you buddy this is obviously a very densely populated grass forest thing and that's bad for defense therefore i should realistically chop these things down to get a clear line of sight on the battlefield. However, just doing this up here takes forever and a lot of stamina. So I propose an alternative, which is uh, cheating. I now no longer lose stamina for a second, meaning I can just cluster bomb everything. It's nature's lawnmower, really, or something like that. We good? Come on, as is important for line of sight. I can only imagine how terrifying this is to any creature that's on looking it to. Why are these guys mad at me? And where did they just come from? Fortunately for them, I'm in cheating mode right now. They don't get to live for long. Yeah, this looks much better now. All right, make a little structure there. Why? Did you not see the dead corpse of your friends? Like, just think for one second. And with this, I can squeeze an acorn turret up there and build it and hop in. Oh yeah, that's looking solid. Now I do need to make a couple of storage baskets for the ammo that my turret should be able to pull from. Also make a little wall here. That'll come in handy later. Step one, done. In a fun and enjoyable manner. Sorry about your home, buddy. 
buddy. Step two, I need to go get my ammo. This last time, there was only just rocks I could shoot out along with pollen rounds, but there's so much more I need to do now. Hello, my beautiful home. Groundy rounds to stop air traveling enemies. Rocky rounds to have a base of what I'm doing. Splody rounds. Well, let me know why. Let's just craft as many of those as I can. And Bernie rounds to set stuff on fire. Sounds good to me, but I don't have enough to make sappy rounds or pointy rounds. Really, one thistle needle off. Also, I need to make a waft emitter, which looks disgusting. Recycle it and put all of those parts into my inventory, please. Except for this one piece of clay. You know what? A little aphid guy, play with that like a soccer ball. Is it starting to be nighttime? Perfect. Perfect. I know exactly where I can go get some salt from and just pick up some sap along the way. Oh, come on. Don't tell me my stairwell into the sand pit also broke. Grounded. Why? And my stairwell to just go up a level? Oh, this is just the worst day. At least this zip line will always remain. Cannonball. It's been a while since I've been in here. Hey buddy, can I interest you in getting punched in the face? Where are you going? Are you digging into the ground? I can't, I can't tell what you're doing. You're, just, you're lashing out. All right. Anyways, you're dead. And I, oh, golden antlion card. Lucky me. Show me the salt. This is the wrong dang cave, but I will be taking this sturdy marble. Oh, wait, yes. One little baby salt cluster. Thank you. Where's another one of the stupid pits at? Down here? No, no, don't even hit me with that, buddy. I'm coming. Oh, he called for backup. Neat. Right, left, right, left, right, left. Oh, one on the right died, one on the left dead. Hang on, I'll be right with you, ain't lying. I just, I want that salt. All right, I'm leaving. I'm not actually gonna be right with you, idiot. So gullible. Why isn't there infected antlions yet, either? I mean, the fungus is here. I don't know, maybe just a thought game. Wow. I'll be honest, I've been on this one long enough. I, th I think I figured out time travel. <laughs> Honey, I'm home. I forgot to grab sap. Bro. Oh, my five goldfish for a memory let me down almost every day. Give me you and you. And I think I just needed five. And actually, all I had to do was complain about them and then they finally remembered something. If I can jump on this dang plant, gimme. With this, I can make a thing of sappy rounds and pointy rounds. Ammo set, murdering a victim, coming soon. Jump and down, safe. Dump these rounds into there. Cause I think this then pulls from them, yeah, in nearby storage. And then I can just change ammo types depending. And then just smack a waft emitter down somehow in the wall. You know what? I'll accept it. I forgot to grab bug parts. I've also changed my turret location so I can actually blast bugs down here. Up high was cool, but I don't think it was going to be effective at all. But with that, there's only one piece of the puzzle that remains. Let me go grab some corpses to make some more corpses. As that saying goes, spend money to make money. I think it's something similar to that. Just a lot more grotesque. <laughs> I believe the way it works, the more parts you put in, the angrier bugs get. So let's grab a few spider chunks, a couple larva spikes, ant parts, some black ox parts would be interesting, and some mosquito fish. Faces. Also, I'm sneaking three roasting spits in here. If I don't eat something, I'm gonna die. Nine grub roast coming right up. Wait, how long have I had cooked food in this fruit? Okay. I'm killing these bugs extra hard now because I'm angry. All right, throw the things in. Oh, it's not multi-bugs, but now I'm gonna get a lot of orb weaver spiders, huh? All right, unleash the waft. Where do they come? What is that? What? No, no, don't pay back from up there, guys. Let me just stay in here for a bit and see if any orb weaver spider actually shows up. A few moments later. Well, they did, but they're uh, in the wrong little spot. All right, not gonna stop me from shooting a rock at him at least. Aim higher. And I, oh, I got one. Eat rock, you jerk. Well, let's relocate, I guess. Here we go. It's like a basic defense for the waft emitter. Let's try this again. Payback's coming from the right over there. All right, that's fine. And now it's it's coming from the left. <laughs> the first payback hasn't even arrived for me yet, guys. Oh, here we go. Can you, no, wait, why would you try and hurt my stairs? Uh-oh, this defense just got a lot more intense. First off, the regular rock rounds, it takes like four to kill these guys. That's not bad. How about my pointy rounds though? Does that do anything? Oh my gosh, I fire those much, much faster. Quick, no, wait, they're already at the wall. Explody rounds, go. Fire in mass. In all honesty, I think that one might be my favorite. Don't really do that much damage as opposed to, you know, a rock to the face, but I still like it. Next, let's bring out some mosquitoes. And also cover up my steps a little bit too, if stuff's gonna try and kill them. Oh, mosquitoes arrived. They take three regular rock shots. Grounded, ground rounds. 
Get grounded, idiot. Fall to the ground. Oh, that's perfect to then just hop out and start smacking them. Thanks for the blood and body parts, friends. This would be a really good way to get some more gold cards. The grounded rounds don't do that much damage, I must admit. How about sappy rounds? Also not a ton of damage, but the slowdown effect is nice. Base defended, success. Oh wait, I can mix. Unleash the waft. I've saved my two favorite rounds for last. Also, weirdly enough, the only tier three and most ammo having rounds I have. Is, uh, is anyone coming? This, this is Wafton, right? Yeah, it's a lot of dead corpses in here. Oh, there they are. Fire. Hit them with the little grounded rounds that did. I think they're stunned a little bit. Slow them down. They can't even get to me because they're so slow. And it's that. Oh, when did this guy get here? And we're out of that ammo. Fine. Bernie round. Oh my gosh. What? This thing has crazy damage. Guys, stop trying to hit that stairwell. Get set on fire, idiots. Look at this burning effect. Ow, it stays and it hurts. I'm moving the location of my turret so I can actually stop them before they get close. Leave my stairwell alone. Get one shot. That's insane. Also, just merely the fact that a lasting fire effect hangs out is nuts. Okay. The moment I get out of the turret, huh? Y'all want to appear and just start trying to kill my base? I see. Get blasted. You guys are walking in the fire. Do you not realize that? Look at them. They're just burning. Payback delivered. My base is still fine. Whatever. Summon out as many black ox beetles as I can. I didn't even get a chance to see the bomb rounds. I was too impressed by the, you know, ignition effect thing. Hang on. Isn't there like a mutation? that helps us. Yeah, guard dog. Turn that on. That gives me more damage, right? I feel like I've gotten stood up on this date. I'm seeing, oh wait, here they come marching in. Is that four of them? Oh, and there's one down there already. I don't know what his health is at because I haven't direct impacted him with a fire thing yet, but it's probably pretty high. Oh, it only does one bar to him. Switch to the bombs. That's fine. How much damage does these do? Not enough. That's all right. Ignite them all. They're just standing in fire like a bunch of idiots. Switch to the bombs now. I can hit all of them with one shot. Yeah, it's a low reload time, but it works. And it's, no, I think they broke my waft emitter. Dang it. You guys really didn't think you were leaving though, right? Why does everyone take like less damage from my hits right now? And the, wh what? What was that? What? Where are you going? Oh, okay. Um, that was weird. Yeet. Either way, safe to say the new turret ammo is busted and very fun to play with. Maybe I should make an actual arena where I can just do base defenses. Get a bunch of resources. Yeah, I think I just got a fun idea. All right, maybe on this zipline I can figure out why she left too.